All right, still us. We we rolling. Hey, we're here at Go Bananas. Oh, that's not Go Bananas. There we go. Yeah, that's a bar. Go Bananas is right here. I'm about to do a stand-up comedy routine, and that's for our One Stop Shop podcast. <clears throat> and like, comment, and subscribe for us. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, sir. Hey, man. I'm about to go on. My nigga, my nigga I think I got a little too drunk. You did a great job. How's it going? How's it going? Woo! How you I would like to start it off by saying Happy Women's Day. Happy Women's Day. Hope you a great day. But. <laughs> I do want to talk about, so Chris Rock just had a special, and I want to talk about Jada Pinkett Smith. I want to talk about Jada Pinkett Accountability. Accountability. She calls everything and walked away like nothing happened. But, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see how Will Smith will come back from there. Again, happy national one <laughs> But I want to talk about something. So in Cincinnati, I, I feel like the drive, the driving on the highway is terrible. It's always like hunger games trying to get on the exit. Like every time you like get near the exit, you see somebody speeding up, and she's like, oh, shit, should I speed up? Should I, should I yield? Like, it's terrible. No, seriously. And uh, another thing. So, so when I be driving sometimes and like, this happens all the time. I'll be like, damn, this person on my back. Like, I was like, damn, like, I, is someone following me? Do I got problems with somebody? Every time, I swear, every time they drive past me, it's be some young lady on her phone texting, speeding, going 16 and 35. And they're like, oh, shit, oh, shit. It's pretty bad. <laughs> don't hit my car, don't hit my car. My neck don't hurt. <laughs> Automatically, I don't care what happens. When they hurt. But uh, I want to take y'all back. Uh, so I want to do, oh, oh, actually, actually. Yeah, so I'm going to do a flashback. Back to when I was about in the fourth grade. Uh, I, was, I, was, I was a great student, if you ask me. But I don't know what the hell happened. At some point for four days, I was in special ed class. And it was, and it was very confusing to me. I mean, well, I, I didn't know what was going on. I thought it was like some little special something going on when it happened, but I, I realized something was bad. Like, this is my very, I, so you see I'm tall. I've never really been bullied a lot. I got bullied in this class. It was this guy. <laughs> he grabbed my arm and shit. I'm like, this ain't normal. <laughs> Bro. I figured out what, and, and, and what's fucked up about it, they never told my mom. So they snuck and did this shit. Man. <laughs> <laughs> we're we're going to guess that this is what's wrong. It was wrong. It's smart as hell. That's <laughs> cool, that's cool. Uh, you know, so I'm from Cincinnati. I'm a huge Bengals fan. And I'm a huge LeBron fan. And being a LeBron fan is like a nine to five job. You gotta, you gotta defend him, his kids, all kinds of shit. I don't know what he done did to people personally. They hate his ass. I was like, I don't see it. He's 40. And he's dunking on 19 year olds every day. Like, how you hate on that? Like, every time you do anything, I swear to God, you're gonna see more laughs than hearts on Facebook. I was like, shit, that was me. Get off the man's back. Well, listen, so I forgot half my material. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
So I got a podcast though. If you want to, if you want to subscribe to the podcast, the one stop shop podcast. If you don't, I'm not for you, but if you do, I love you for it. You're a lovely person. I like it. So hey, but I got some when I listen. Bro, I got this, bro. I got some kickers when I re- oh. <laughs> smelled like Ja Rule <laughs> when I grew up because 50 Cent made that I smell pussy that you Ja Rule <laughs> like, when I grew up that shit don't smell like Ja Rule <laughs> <laughs> hey no, 50 Cent is a terrible person he's like an evil he's like an evil villain <laughs> that you love like, he bully everybody but I watch anything he do. Like, I don't care, I personally. If I don't get offended at all, I'm a Virgo. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for your next comedian, Terry. <laughs> <laughs>